This is the Schmo with the Pro going into his second season. Marvin Bagley the third, Team USA training camp. How we doing? I'm good, man. I'm good. Can't complain at all. You look good out there, man, for the select team. Is your goal from all this to get on that national team? Oh uh, man, yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, I just came out here the last, you know, few days and just play hard every time I got out there. Um, you know, whatever happens, happens. So I'm just having fun. I'm enjoying it all, enjoying this whole experience. And, uh, you know, we got one more day tomorrow. And then after that, you know, we'll see. Lottery pick out of Duke. Your teammate, Buddy Heald, he bet the house you guys would make the playoffs. Your Sacramento Kings. It didn't happen, though, man. So is this house up for sale? Whatever happened to that? Oh, man, that's between Buddy and uh, whoever, he, whoever he said that to. Um, you know, I, but no, I think we'll make it this year. You know, we have a good you know, chance. We have a, a lot of great pieces to our team um, that we were missing last year. So uh, I'm excited. I'm, I'm definitely excited about going into to year two. You got your point guard out here, De'Aaron Fox. Man, what kind of chemistry are you guys going to build right here in the hardwood in Las Vegas that you'll carry on for the regular season? Well, heads up. Heads up. Got a ball uh, going through. I mean, I think it's good for us to be out here, man, um, just to compete and have fun with each other. Uh, you know, those guys are on the national team doing their, doing their thing, and, um, you know, it's great. You know, you just had a, a long season with these guys, and um, to kind of see them um, out here going hard, competing like, like, just like I am, um, it's, it's great. Who is the toughest big man to go up against during your rookie season? Oh, man, it was a, it was a lot of people that were good. Uh, Someone that stands out, though. Toughest night for you. Um, I, I really, I would say, I like playing Giannis. Ante Tacompo. Yeah, that's that's my that was my favorite player to play against. Um, you know, I think we have not similar games, but you know, he's he can get it off the off the uh, board and push, create for his team. Uh, ball, 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 ball. That one hit his head. The one hit you in the chin. That one hit on the top of the head. Yeah, but uh, he's he, he's good. He's good. Uh, he's, he's okay. Good? Okay. Uh, uh, what was the question again? That threw me off. It's, it's totally okay, man. So you got Coach K over there at Duke. He's a legend, probably yes, the sir. greatest of all time. Yes, How does sir. his style differ from a Van Gundy out here? Um, I mean, I, I feel like it's, it's similar in a lot of ways because, you know, when I was at school, we, we liked to run. We got out. Um, we tried to run and, you know, push the pace a little bit. Um, I think here, you know, Van Gundy was, you know, Always telling us to run, get out, you know, sprint, get back. So I think it's similar in those ways. Um, you know, I think coach just had a little bit different plays than uh, than what they have drawn up for us here. Uh, but you know, it's a lot of similarities in um, you know the style of play. You big into Dragon Ball Z like your teammate De'Aaron Fox? I think he took a charter plane after a game one day to go see it live in Los Angeles. Nah, I'm not into it. I've heard of it. I've heard of it. Um, you know, I used to watch it when I was a little younger, um, but I've never really been, you know, a big fan. I haven't, you know, I didn't dig into it like that. But, um, you know, I, I definitely know what it is, and I've seen it before. But if you ask me characters and stuff like that, I, I probably couldn't tell you. What are you a big fan of, Marvin? Uh, I like I love music. That's 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 my my passion. You know, outside the court, uh, other than basketball. Um, I love music. Um, that's what I've been, you know, doing know, forever, making music and uh, learning, writing music, writing songs, and, um, you know, that's something that I love to do. The Schmo could put you on the spot and ask you to uh, sing a song, but we're not going to do that to you. <laughs> you know, no, 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 wait, wait for the album. Album coming soon. What's the date? Uh, we're still, still in, the, in the works with that, but uh, all the songs are finished. You know, just waiting on a couple things to be finalized, um, but, you know, Real soon, real soon. He's dropping an album. We'll get you out of here on this. What's your one message for the Marvin Bagley the third fans worldwide? Uh, you know, never quit, never give up. You know, if you got a dream, go get it. Never let nobody tell you you can't do something. Um, just keep going, keep going. Never, never give up. Like I said, and you'll get to where you want to be. And we'll get the Kings in the playoffs this season. Yes, absolutely. He's the pro. Absolutely. I'm the Schmo. Absolutely. We're out. <laughs>